Greetings, models and viewers alike. My name is CA15, and today we are shopping. Or at least that's what we're doing right now. Like, we're gonna go like hang out with some people in just a bit. All righty then. Uh, let's us go. I believe we should be able to hang out with Yosuke today. Uh, hi. What do you have for me? Melon seedlings. Sure. Uskis? I mean, sure. I've got the money. What the heck? Am what the heck am I buying? What is this melon seedling? Hectic. Um, let us go take a look to see if we can hang out with Mr. Hanamura. This should be at rank 9, yes? And if so... Yes! Uh, Personas. Pixie, you're a... Yes, magician. Yo! <laughs> Alright! Alright then. The hill overlooking town. Yes, Gabe brought you here. I hated this place when I first came to Inaba. You can tell how small the town is from up here. Alright, so I was right. This one is voiced. But looking at it now, it's a nice town. It is! <laughs> yes, Kay, smiling sadly. Still sad about Saki Senpai? Hmm. Not as much as last time. But I still feel lonely. Yes, Kay is looking far off. I want to tell Saki Senpai something. That what's important isn't where you are. This town I hated so much. Now I love it. I mean, there's still nothing here, but I have family and friends and you. Aww. The important things are never far off. They're all around you. Yosuke seems a bit embarrassed. And I always wanted to be special. I thought my life would finally have meaning if I was special to someone. That's why I was really excited when I got my persona. But I really didn't need it. It's not what you have or what you can do. Just being born, living your life. Before you know it, you're already special to someone. Right? Th this is true, guys. Like This is genuinely true. You're already special to someone. Like, yeah. You're right. Yeah, like you. You're special to me, you know? Aww. Th guys, this sounds genuinely, this sounds like a rank 10 confidant, not a rank, um, not a rank 9. Yosuke is rubbing his nose. You can see, feel Yosuke's warm trust. Feel, yeah, that thing. Yeah, it's rank 9, not rank 10. This sounds like rank 10 dialogue, so I wonder what's gonna happen in rank 10. Alright, let's see if we can find everyone's house from here. That sounds like a great idea. There's Juness, and that's the main street, so my house is there. The one with that funky roof, meaning yours is... Spent a long while with Yosuke. Welcome back. Thank you. Uh, can't hang out with Nanako. Maybe Dojima? Maybe. I'm thinking we spend time with Dojima, yes? We can also hang out with Rise, right? No, I read that wrong. Hectic. Hey! Wait, it won't become closer yet. Nah. Wait, hot. Okay, I have a feeling that I need to hang out with Nanako first. Uh, let us take a look and see if there's anyone whom I can hang out with tonight. Preferably one of my friends so I can... Alright, so I was right. I can't hang out with Risei. I'm very likely going to hang... Yeah, I'm just going to hang out with her. That way, next time I hang out with her during the day, it's oh, no problem. Senpai. Yes, why not? <laughs> 
Sometimes I come here and look at the sky. The view is so different from here than in the city. You can see all the stars in here, nothing but insects. It's also way easier to see shooting stars. But you don't but don't you find it hard to make your wish three times before it's gone? I always mess that up. But you have to make the wish three times before it's gone? But you just had to wish upon a shooting star. Hey Sampai, if there was one going by right now, what would you wish for? I mean, don't get me wrong, this is very appealing to me right now. Peace also sounds pretty freaking good, don't get me wrong. But we want support Porta 3, say. Come on. Why is that? You don't need to wish on a star for that city. I'm standing right in front of you. Oh, shooting star. Quick, Senpai. Let's make our wishes. Woo. Oh. oh. Wow, it's the state already? Sorry, I gotta get back. Oh, before I go, give me your hand, Senpai. I want you to have it, Senpai. Rich milk candy. Thank you. Ta-da, surprise present. Haha, <laughs> did I get you? Oh, good night. I don't know why I like Rise so much, but she's just. I just like her. Like. So much so that she's like the only person I'm gonna date in this timeline. Oh, who are you? Morning! Is your motorcycle all gassed up? Remember how I mentioned how we should all go to the beach before? Why not go today? I've been looking forward to it, my boy. Right? When you think of the summer, you think of the beach. And vice versa. I'm sure suntan skin and a little accidental hand slipping is in our future. Damn it, Yosuke. Oh man, I'm so excited. Yosuke seems delighted. I'll go ahead and call up the others. See you later. Cheers, cheers. The sky is bright and clear today. It's a perfect day for nodding. Oh yeah, an anime cutscene. Still doing that weird frame rate thing, but it's fine. Senpai, is the beach really this way? We've been on the road for a while. I'm positive. But can't you smell the ocean? What smell? <laughs> you can definitely trust her on this, Rise. She's got the senses of a beast, remember? What? <laughs> What are you saying? Hey, you? I was complimenting you. You call that a compliment, you idiot? What kind of girl wants to be compared to a big man? Hey, dude, give me a break, will ya? Have you seen the map? This is crazy. This is genuinely cruel. <laughs> like it would be better to for me. To to tell Teddy to like one of the scooters <laughs> at the very least the ocean! All right. uh, oh, it's pretty You know, I'm starting to get nervous. I wonder if what happened during um, Persona 5 and Persona 3 is going to happen here. I mean, technically speaking, Yosuke, uh, you and Kanji already went trying to pick up girls. But it wasn't on the beach, so let's see if that happens here. We're at the ocean, which means swimsuits, which means reset live and in person. What are the ramifications here? Am I using up my lifetime supply of luck with this? No. Dude, Hakuna Yatata, just calm down. It's just swimsuits, boy. Like, literally. Like, go to high school and swim club, and then there you go. Whoa! Ooh! People get way too excited over the prospect of seeing skin. 
were you waiting for us? Dude, that's just insane! Yeah, she's something else. It's more normal than I expected. I've already seen. <laughs> no, 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 no. Definitely not that one. Summer is awesome. Hey, were you checking me out, senpai? Rise is smiling mischievously. Um, can we get going into the water? Chie-chan, Rise-chan, and Yuki-chan all win the Ladies of Summer competition. I'm surrounded by such beautiful mermaids. I feel like this could be my chance for a summer romance. Good luck with that, Daddy. Like that had ever happened. Where's Kanji? I bet he's still worn out. Riding all that way on a bike really did a number on him. Oh, here he comes. I'm gonna go on record here, right? I hate swimsuits like that. On, uh, let me just make the record clear. On guys and girls. Like, I know earlier just now I was saying, uh, you guys are way too... Like, I hate speedos. Hate them with a the passion. What's what? Your swimsuit! What else would I mean? It's your basic black. What? I'm not talking about the color. I mean, I mean... The, the whole thing! I'm seeing things I never needed to see! You're the only one saying stuff like that. Don't act like you're not egging me on! Hmm. Wait, Poor Kanji. choice of words. How come you're not getting a nosebleed over me? Huh? Why would that happen? What? <laughs> I'm surprised they can get this worked up over just some swimsuits. Right. Jeez, they're hopeless. I'm gonna go ahead and jump in the water. Chie chan, Yuki chan, let's be mermaids! Okay, genuine question. Teddy, can you swim? Whee! Hey, he went in first! Come on, you two, let's go! Oh wait, is you teaching Yukiko how to swim? Am I, was I the only one who saw that? Found a betting machine. I'll go buy some drinks. You want a soda? Wait a second. Oh god, what am I feeling? I know what's about to happen. Oh! My string's getting undone. God damn it! Boys, turn hey, around. Daddy, watch the hands, pal. Damn it, Ted. God damn it. Aw, don't be so stingy. I think we're due for a wardrobe malfunction. Teddy, that is... That is very close to sexual assault. I think it is sexual assault. Please don't do that. What in the world are they doing? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What now? Uh, yep, I was right. God, you, you bastard. Busted. Thank you, Kanchi, for being the Teddy police. Hey, Senpai, this stupid bear here. Hey, hey, hey! Not cool! You listening, Senpai? Wait, hold it! Time out! Uh, look down! Down? <laughs> <laughs> what was that sound effect? Holy shit, the wardrobe malfunction was mine! <laughs> what are you doing? You need to cover up down there! I give up! I give up! Hey, quit squirming! You run off and I'm toast! But if I don't run off, my dignity will be in ruin! Why don't we take a break? I need to put on more sunscreen. Gotta take a break to slake with steak! To slake with steak? Kanji, They're run! Get out of the water! Daddy, what gives? I'm done for. I'll go look for something! Sit tight! Kanji, where are your shorts? This is an emergency. <laughs> this... Okay, gents. This is never good advice. Let's find you a swimsuit, man. But 
There's no way. We, we ain't got enough time for that. I can hear the harps. <laughs> Stay with us, Ted. All right, Kanji. I found something. Wait, that's seaweed. Oh, there they are. Senpai! They're coming! Just hide it! All oh, honesty, gents, I can appreciate the effort. Never let a... <laughs> what am I supposed to say to this? <laughs> I can't! I actually can't! Oh, dude, that's hilarious. Oh, that's genuinely hilarious. Uh, we're, uh, reenacting the birth of Venus? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm ready to be born, damn it. You sicko! Was this the best idea? Nope. Whatever else, it's giving me an itch. Uh huh. You won't manage to win a better battle, or so you tell yourself. The sun is starting to set. Pretty busy day. I'm still itchy. At least we had a laugh over it in the end, right? And we found your swimsuit, too. Well, I never would have come to the beach if you hadn't invited me. <laughs> I guess it would be out of character for you. It actually might be more fun to try stuff that's out of character. Yeah. In a way, your nature is like a wall, after all. Surrounding yourself with high walls makes things simple, but simplicity isn't always a virtue. Yosuke, this is the damn truest thing you said all day. Shoot. Oh man, what was that? Did I just get all philosophical there? Yeah, you did. By all means, keep going. Oh well, if I have your permission. Come on, you're embarrassing me even more. I think it's fine. I look at that big ocean out there and think, man, why keep hanging on to all this embarrassment? Just let it go. So you don't deny that it was embarrassing, huh? Here are the girls playing at the beach. And Teddy. Okay, why don't we play a game? Whoever loses has to buy barbecue on a stick for everyone else. But that surprise only you would want to play for, Chie-senpai. That is true. Then the loser gets to smooch Teddy! Once again, that's a prize that only Teddy would want to play for. Talk about kicking someone when they're down. Then instead of playing a game, why don't we do something else together? Like burying Teddy in the sand. You mean like giving him a sand bath? Oh no, my wrist is red. I was so careful to put sunscreen on too. They're nice birds and having fun. Good times never last long. I wonder if our high school days will end that way too. What's with all the doom and gloom? The case is closed, man. If anything, I'd say we're just getting started. Dude, I've, I think I've still got half of this game left. That's true. Man, though, this motorcycle trip turned out way better than I imagined. Hey, I've got an idea. Why don't we go skiing during winter break? Wait till you guys see how awesome I am on a snowboard. Talking about winter already? Getting a little ahead of ourselves, are Kay. we? I know I have until December. I look forward to it. Yeah! There's lots of mountains around here, so there's gotta be a ski slope somewhere not too far away. Oh yeah, tons of them. None of them are that close by, but it won't be too tough by scooter. Though we gotta stay safe. If the roads look dangerous, we might have to change our plans. Man, I wouldn't have thought you'd be the one stressing safety. Point of trying to act cool when it comes to that stuff. Danger's danger, man. Well, you have a point. All right. Now that we have a plan in mind for winter break, let's start heading back before it gets dark. We're all beginners at driving, after all. Probably a good idea. Hey, we're going home. You enjoyed your day swimming in the ocean, towing my scooter. It was a memorable day. Please tell me we'll have our nighttime slot. Nope, okay. The end of summer is fast approaching, but Nanako still has some homework left to do. 
According to her, there's a huge pile of homework. The objective of Nanako's homework is to tighten the bond between her family members by doing homework together. It's too much for Nanako to finish all by herself. Should you help Nanako with her homework for the next few nights? Mm, fine. As oh wait, game, I had better have my day slots. Really? Thank you, big bro. No problem. Then I'll start working on spelling practice. Nanako is doing her best to practice her spelling. She seems to be doing well, but you decided to double check her work anyway. Alright, good, I have my day. No, no, I'm, I'm not gonna do I'm not gonna do homework. I've I've seen this in Persona 5. When I watched the playthrough of Persona 4 last time, right? I remember that like the homework will automatically be done on the last night anyway, yeah? Alright, so looks like we can hang out with Marie. So we're gonna hang out with Marie, yeah? Sorry about that, the recording just suddenly stopped. Uh but yeah, now that we're here, we go into town. Uh, we head to Central Shopping District, and if we can, we hang out with Marie. Preferably, we hang out with Marie. No, I. Mm. Hurry, let's go. It says it will deepen. However, I'm, guys, I'm going to be honest with you. If we don't, if it doesn't deepen, I'm going to reload my save. Brought a contemplated Marie here. Okay, I think it is actually going to deepen. I don't get this. What am I supposed to do? The lady at the store said this comb was something special. She said it was old. Yeah, she did. She also said she's never seen one like this before. What did she say? Museum? Gallery? Uh, would there be combs there? I don't get it. That doesn't make sense. What are they going to use them for? They're antiques. And what? You mean all the dirty things? Oh, but maybe it is. Just like those, this comb has no point? Marie seems impressed. Do you know anyone who knows about stuff like that? Who around here would know about art techniques? Um, I think Di old man Diadara. Someone who might know, huh? The sound is a ton of weird people here. Let's go. Well, let's go. Maybe we'll find something out. Shopping district, Diadara. A uh, Diadara. I don't, I don't know. Why well, saw these? Who would buy them? Yuki chan, wait for me. All this stuff is so heavy. Blah. Oh. I knew it. Good day, Yuki. Marie chan. Huh, Sensei. Emi chan. Oh. Actually, what were Yukiko and Teddy doing hanging out? Looks like I've scumbled across a big swoop. Well, well. And you two? Oh, no, what should I do? They're on to us, Yuki-chan. I'm buying supplies at the end. I need to Teddy on the way, so I'm letting him carry everything. Uh, Yuki-chan totally blew me off. Teddy! It is what it is, man. It's all piled up next to the store. I can't carry another thing. Who's this? How cruel, Emi-chan. You, you, have you already forgotten about little Teddy? After all the heavy uh, petting you gave my fur. Oh, that's right. You never met Teddy out of his costume yet. Teddy, oh, kindness and fur. Correct, that's why I'm chan That is love. This has to be the power of love. Yeah, it's not. What are you two doing here? Oh, shopping, I guess? We're doing some research. I see. Uh, here. This. Hey, do you know what this is? Oh, this is... It's a very unique comb. What about it? 
You want to learn about it, yeah. Honestly, I don't know anything, though. Me neither. I've never seen this before. But it's really pretty. Sh nice and shiny. Ah, so that's why you're here. The owner does seem like he'd know about antiques. I knew it. Will he know anything about it? Not sure. Let's ask and find out. Alright. Leave the interrogation to me. Hey, buddy. I got some... <laughs> Teddy. Teddy, Teddy, Teddy. That's not how you ask questions. For me? Well, unless it's about art, you ain't getting any answers. Do you know anything about this? I come. I don't sell. Mm. Hey, this is a beaut. Good craftsmanship. Pretty old too. And yet it doesn't show much wear. It's perfect. Almost too perfect. Where'd you get this? Um. Do you know anything about this? We'd be grateful for anything you could tell us. Mm. Nope. It's a comb, definitely. But what? But whether it's just an accessory or part of a festival, heck, I don't even know when it was made. Oh. I see. Oh, hold on there, Missy. I can at least tell you what it's made out of. Yeah, this is not your average bamboo. It's something similar to a rare type of bamboo that grows in the Chigoku region. But... But it... Um... Uh, wait. But it's not? No, it's definitely not normal bamboo. It's beautiful, though. I'd almost think it's something from another world. Another world? So what world is it from? I don't under... <sighs> That sounded violent. Marie looks like she's in pain. Uh, don't, are you alright? I'm an alright. My head, it hurts. Whoa, whoa, hold on there, Missy. Have a fit state kid around here somewhere. I'll go look for some medicine, too. I may be faster to get some from a neighbor. Wait up, Yuki Chan. I'll go with you. Uh. What is this? What the heck? I don't get it. This is bugging me. Something pops up that just disappears when just when I had it. Try again? I'm trying, doing my best, but my head hurts. Makes me angry. I still can't remember anything. Marie is trying hard to regain her lost memory. You can sense Marie's urgencies. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I think I'll max her up before December. Like, I don't think I need to worry about that. I'm going home, my head still hurts. Bye. After thanking everyone, you escort Marie back to the Velvet Room. I mean, the Velvet Room is like, right next door. Ah, yeah, 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 Nanako's homework, lovely. Tried three proverbs for my homework today. Oh, I know one, it's, um... A rolling stone gathers no moss. That always tells me that one. Who can that be? Oh, Yosuke and Teddy. We had a, le a little secret, a little event going on at UNES today. Here's a souvenir for you, Nanako-chan. Oh, are, are you doing your summer homework? I feel sorry for you. Alright, I'll help you, Nanako-chan. Um, Proverbs. Oh, uh, I have one. Kogito ergo sum. <sighs> Where did you pick that up? Don't cast pearls before you swine, it's more like something you'd say. Yosuke and Teddy, Teddy, Teddy helped Nanako with her homework. Yay! This is helping my support with those, with those two, so that's great. Um, I'm not doing homework! Nothing you can do will make me do homework, I don't... I do not care. And ooh, Adachi! All right, that is actually a damn good idea. Hanging out with Adachi. F me, God damn! I need to hang out with Adachi. Um, Central Shopping District. Devil, Moon, Sun, Priest, Lovers, Priest. I have so many Priestess Personas. Empress, Aeon, Chariot, Emperor, Magician. Alright, uh, who am I to Priestess Personas? No, you're... Okay. 
Okay, you're actually one of my combat personas, so probably not getting rid of you. Uh, you I can get rid of, but like that Invigorate 2 is pretty damn useful. So I think what we'll do is we'll do a Young Fusion. Yeah. And then grab a persona of Adachi's Arcana. Nothing happening today? Um, so we'll fuse... Sarasvati and wow, that's depressing. Dekarabia, but I don't want to get rid of these guys. Okay, you know what? We'll come back. Yeah. Oh wait, uh, no, it, it, it's fine. We'll just hang out with Adachi without... No, 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 we won't. We get rid of Pixie, because Pixie's like the cheapest persona. I can buy her back. Then we will hang out with Yosuke another day. When we next time we hang out with Yosuke, we'll grab Gur. We'll grab Pixie. I cannot English today. <coughs> oh. Mmm, damn it! <laughs> Bollocks! You've not been hanging out with the dead uh, uh, Adachi enough. Writes an essay about something I remember. Hmm. She ain't Yukiko. I heard from Yosuke that Nanako chan is doing her homework. I'm here to help you. You're writing an essay? Have you decided on a topic, Nanako chan? Not yet. Let's see. How about the time when we went to the festival together? That's right, the Ikeyaki was so good, I had so much fun. Nanako begins writing her essay. Chie and Yukiko help Nanako with her essay. Whoa. I'm gonna grow closer to... Wait, only Chie and Nanako? What about Yukiko? Not do... Oh, hello? It's me, Chie. Hey, do you mind hanging out with me today? Um... Sure, I think. Yeah. All right. Let us max out Chie's confidant, Samagawa Riverbank. We trained with Chie like always. Okay, I think that's enough for today. Chie seems more enthusiastic than usual. Yeah, I feel like I haven't been that on form in a while. Hey, um. There's something I want to tell you. Something I've been thinking about all this time. Yeah. I, I still don't have a clue what my good points are. But I thought I could just keep on searching. I just want to protect people. And to do it, I'll stand up and fight. I'm going to fight alongside you till the very end. I wouldn't have it I any mean, other way. We'll always be friends. Is it me, or did I detect pain in, pain in that line? Like, I don't know, maybe that was just me. Of course. Yeah. Chie is smiling gently. This is from me to you. You obtained wristbands. Oh, and it's new, so it's clean. It makes a matching pair with mine. <laughs> I think this power of mine is what I wanted all along. The power to protect everyone. I understand now. I'm not supposed to use it to become more self-reliant. I'm supposed to use this power to protect people. Yukiko, my friends, my family, this town, and you. Okay, guys, I'm, if I'm being honest, I genuinely think I should have maxed out Shia and Yosuke a long time ago. I should have. I've actually been had cuck management of my supports. Supports, wrong game. Social links.
Ooh, all right. First second awakening. Chie's strong will has allowed her to accept and overcome her weaknesses, has awakened to her heart's true power. Ooh. Chie's persona has been reborn. Uh, Suzuka Gongen. My new power! I have you to thank for this. No matter how far apart we may be in the future, we'll be okay. This feeling won't ever change. It sense Chie's strong resolve. Feel a tight bond between you and Chie. Yes! Well, we need... The path is open? That's what this song is? Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast established a genuine bond. These genuine bonds shall be your eyes to see the truth. We bestow upon thee the ability to create Futanushi, the ultimate... Wait, Futanushi? Ah! Thought you were a magician. Okay. Oh, yes! <laughs> okay, all right, 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 this is, we'll get rid of that people, thanks. We ain't getting rid of that one anytime soon, I can tell you that now. All right then, my body and mind are all worn out, let's go get some meat, and I mean the good stuff! Shoot fam, you had me at meat? So I had to look over Nanaka's homework. For today's homework, I have to write a book report. I've always finished, uh, already finished reading a book. I just need to write about it. A king goes into a deep forest and... Nanaka puts a lot of effort into her book report. He was all alone, so he wasn't angry or sad. The king said he was happy, but I feel sad for him. Um, big bro, do you feel happy when you're alone? I mean, it depends. Yeah, it depends. I see. Maybe I should write about you too. Summer break will be over soon. There's some homework left. What's that? I'm not doing homework, guys. Like, I'm gonna do it all on the last night. Facts. Uh, we won't be able to... Do we maintain the garden today? Okay, it's raining, so we wouldn't really be able to hang out with anyone. Uh, yeah. Yeah, let's maintain the garden. Nanako, please do not... Uh, please bring an umbrella. We do not want you getting sick. I wonder if they're ready yet. Oh, I saw an earthworm. Earthworms help the soil, my teacher also said. Uh, uh, when I showed Itachi son one the other day, <laughs> he hates bugs. They don't know why. Earthworms are good bugs. Decide to look over Nanako's homework. I'm doing art. My ho wait, what? I'm doing my art homework today. I have to make something out of stuff I find in the house. Milk carton, paper towel tube, knitting wool, origami paper. So, uh, Kanji's gonna make an appearance just now. Watch. What else do we have? Someone here today, too? We you saying Kanji came by? Senpai said that Nanako chan was doing her summer homework. You should have told me. But it looks like I picked the wrong day. I can't do it, any of this art stuff. Me neither. Huh? Let's see what you got. Kanji to the rescue! Kanji carefully crafts something with incredible detail and creates something that no elementary student could make. Man, Kanji is the frickin' plug. Huh? Is it. Are you bored today? Senpai, let's go somewhere. Um, I wanted to end the video, uh, so but not. I'll just hang out with Risei then. 
We'll end the video later. Yeah. Central Shopping District. We decided to walk Risei home after eating at Aya. <laughs> the flavor was a little strong, but it felt good. My grandma's food is kind of bland, though tofu is good for you, so... There's a suspicious man in front of Risei's house. Oh. Is that a reporter? Or a stalker? Risei is worried. Um, do we grab her hand and run? Do we call the police or do we yell? Uh... Yeah... Grab her hand and run, sure. It's alright, we don't know if he's dangerous or not. Let's wait and see, but thanks for that. Risa no longer seems worried. Hmm, but still, that guy, where have I? Pretty sure it's your manager. No way! In no ways, in no ways, son, is that you? Risa chan Why are you here? I already select, uh, settled everything with the agency. I'm here because, personally, I can't accept that. I've watched you this entire time as your manager. I'm no longer a personality. My private time doesn't belong to a manager anymore. Go home. If you don't, I'll call the police. Wait. Could you just think it over? I strongly believe that no other actress can play that role better than Risei Kujikawa. Your fans were looking forward to the movie, too. You still want me to act? Huh? Anyway, I'm through with it. I have nothing to do with showbiz and all that stuff now. I... I decided to marry this man once you graduate high school. I love how you just doesn't have an uh, exclamation or anything like that. He's just like, okay, this is my life now. I said before I was only on a hey, Eunice, but I've changed my mind. There's no way I'm coming back. You sees the real me. He's so gentle. Risa is desperate. Dude, of course. He went along with her story. See, I told you. Risa looks relieved. I understand. I'll go home for today. But I... Go away, now. Um. That was Inoue's son. He was my manager. I'm like a daughter. I'm his daughter's age. So he treated me like one of the family. But he's a stranger now. Senpai, um. I'm sorry, Senpai. Dude, it's no, it's no worries. Trust. Lying about marrying you and all. Psh wasn't a lie. <laughs> oh, yes. It was... Wow. Somewhat at a loss, Risa is smiling sheepishly. You really are a nice guy. This isn't good. I feel like I'm gonna depend on you even more. <laughs> Just kidding. Perhaps due to her relief, Risa is smiling... Rank 4, yes. Ooh, that- Ooh, nani? When selecting a target, you can check to see whether- the Oh! Okay. Wish I could spend more time with you, but I'll save it for next time. See you later, senpai. Wait, I didn't see what confidant rank we were at. Uh... Level 4. Alright, sweet. Think I'll still be able to max out Rise, preferably before December. Decide to look over Nanako's homework. I have to write a paper about my favorite animal. Which one should I choose? Oh, I know. There's a picture of it on the shirt dead port. What's it called? A platypus? Yes, write about platypus. It doesn't seem to need any help, but you make sure she's on the right track. The platypus lays eggs. They have poisonous cloth. Hmm. Question. Is it the male or female platypus that has poisoned claws? Um. Nanako, I will uh, be with you in a quick second. I am just going to go take a look at a thing at Google and figure out what the correct answer is. Um. Yeah.
So it looks like it's only males that have it. Correct, you're smart, big bro. Whew! Alright, thank you, Google. Hashtag not sponsored. Alright, can I save? Please, someone don't call me. I'm not working on... Fudge! I didn't decide to do this. I didn't want to do this! Why did you do this? This is the last thing I have to do for my homework. I just need to write a picture diary. Um, big bro and dad. Let's see, August 27th. Uh, I don't remember the weather. Um, big bro, did it rain that day we worked on my art homework? Fudge! I wasn't paying attention! I think it was raining all day. Wait... It was raining all day? Was it? Apparently not. Big Bro and his friends helped me a lot with my homework. They were so nice, I liked them so much. No, don't look. Can I please save? Like, please, do not auto-load me into anything. For five snakes! Good morning, Senpai. It's me, Arise. I, I'm not mad that it's you, but thank you all so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe for more content on this channel. Till next time, this is Cyber signing out. Peace.